Thanks. Right now, leaders moving forward with major redevelopment plans when it comes to Charlotte's transit system. A key board signing off on the route of the Silver Line, that's for light rail, while the Metropolitan Transit Commission also approving a final design for Charlotte's new transportation center in Uptown. Wake up Charlotte's Richard Urvain now live for us this morning. Richard, some groups are, are expressing some concern about how this is all going to be paid for. Yeah, Ben, good morning to you. Good Wednesday morning, all. Yeah, the group Sustained Charlotte, which advocates for smart growth here in this area, is very concerned about the way that CATS plans to grow their transit system, and they're concerned about how they also plan to fund it. CATS officials say they're now sticking with their original route plans for the 29 miles Silver Line from Union County to Gaston. Instead of alternate plans, it would have run it directly through Uptown, and they say it would have been more cost effective. It is the most reliable option at a higher cost. The commission did approve one change to the Silver Line where it runs along Bojangles Coliseum. The key distinctions there between those two lines are about the ability, the yellow line is able to keep the street network the same, but requires a taller bridge that goes over Briar Creek Road and Independence Boulevard. Katz also says moving the transit center uptown underground is the best option because it would integrate light rail and the bus hub and will be easier for riders to navigate than the two-level option that was struck down. Simple transfer between bus routes, consolidated climate controlled space, uh, somewhat more easy to, uh, to maintain security given just the one platform to, to monitor, more efficient bus routing. The total Silver Line budget could cost nearly $9 billion. Katz is working to secure the funding, while groups like Sustain Charlotte have concerns about construction and operational costs, as well as the future of the center. That includes if that actual location is ever sold or, or purchased by someone else who would maintain control of that building. Also, we can tell you that that underground transit center expected to start construction in 2025. As far as the Silver Line construction, that's expected to have the first phase construction underway sometime after 2030. We're here in Uptown. Richard Devane for Wake Up Charlotte. Talking about some long-term plans. All right, Richard, thank you. Cats also making it easier for folks commuting on the blue line to get to and from work. It's increasing the frequency of some trains to every 15 minutes. That's up from 20 minutes it's currently at. The increased frequency happening weekdays, 7 to 9 a.m. and then in the afternoon from 4 to 6 p.m.